The operation of the Panama Canal is now threatened by the droughts and reduced rainfall brought on by global warming. One of the most important waterways in the world is the Panama Canal. The future of the marine route is in danger due to the continuous water crisis. Due to a lack of rainfall, Panama's colonies to artificial lakes have become drained. Due to this, the Panamanian Economic Authority for the fifth time this drought season limited the largest ships from passing through the canal. According to the authority, one of the lake's water levels dropped by 7 meters, or more than 10 percent, between the 21 staff March and the 21 staff April. The Panama Canal handles 6 percent of all maritime shipping worldwide. This comes primarily from China, Japan, and the United States. Rainwater is the energy source used to drive ships through the canal's locks as it connects the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans. 200 liters of fresh water go to the sea for each boat that travels through the canal. Because of this, it's critical that the two feeder lakes stay filled. Moving forward, the canal requires 5.25 billion cubic meters of fresh water to run. Bells have been sounding since the year 2019 has passed, when there are only 3 billion cubic meters of supplies. Authorities are racing to come up with measures that would ensure operations in the long run. More than half of the 4.3 million people living in the country receive their water from the Panama Canal Basin. Water problems between the canal and the surrounding people could occur, experts warn. According to the general manager of the Panama Meteorology and Hydrology Institute, the administration of the canal is doing wonders to keep up business and perform social obligations, such providing drinking water for human consumption.